Assalamu alaikum my dear students. Hello, how are you all? Hope you are fine by the grace of Almighty Allah. Welcome to NFS Home School and this is Ariful Islam, Assistant Teacher of English, National Indian English Version School, Barnakshik. Today I am going to contact an English second paper class for class 7 students. Our today's topic, narration interrogative. So let's see my dear students. Our today's topic, uh, there is a mistake here. To this date, date 8, 4, 2, 1, term half yearly, class 7, subject English second paper, topic narration interrogative, lecture number 10, is it will be 8, teacher Ariful Islam, and this is my mobile number. So, my dear students, let's start the class. My dear students, uh, I have taken the class of narration as a tip, lecture number 9. So if you do not cover, if you do not watch lecture 9, you will not understand lecture number 10. So first watch lecture 9, narration as a tip, then come to this class. So first one, you can see, he said to me, do you know me? So in interrogative sentence, this is an interrogative sentence. Okay, he said to me, so in interrogative sentence, reporting verb, said to, will be changed into, he asked, in, instead of said to, we have to put asked, then we have, to, we have to give me, so he asked me. If our interrogative sentence starts with the auxiliary verb, do, does, did, am, is, are, was, were, have, has, had, can, could, may, might, and the model auxiliaries uh, can, could, may, might, shall, should, will, would. So, if the interrogative sentence in the reported speech it starts with the auxiliary verb, we have to put here if or whether. We use whether when mentioned there is any choice. So, he asked me if. And there is another important thing. This is an interrogative sentence. When we will make it indirect speech, we have to make this sentence into assertive sentence. So we have to make this sentence into assertive sentence. So if you want to make it assertive, we have to put subject first. So you second person follow the object of reporting verb me. Then you will be changed into I. Me is changed, changed into I. So this is do you know me present if it tense. Again, we have to take change the tense so if I present if any tense most of the students do it if I did this is wrong because do is the auxiliary verb in past this is present if any tense if you want to make it past if any tense we have to make past verb of the main verb principal verb so the answer will be if I knew me will will follow the subject he okay he and me is the objective form here that's why we have to put objective form of him him okay so he asked me if i knew him next one she said to me have you done the work so she instead of said to you have to put ask interrogative sentence me and have you done the work have the interrogative sentence starts with auxiliary verb. That's why we have put we have to put if. Then you will be follow the object me and you will be I. And as we are making uh, this interrogative sentence is to assertive. That's why we have we have put after if the subject. So have you done the work present perfect tense will change into past perfect tense. So if I had down the work you can remember like this am is there will change into was where have as will be changed into had he said to me where do you live so instead of said to we have to put asked me will be same okay next look this sentence starts with where do you live this interrogative sentence starts with no auxiliary verb w is word so if you find wh word in uh, reported speech interrogative sentence we have to put this wh word who 
what, where, how, whom, anyone. In this case, W's word will be used. So where? Again, we have to make it assertive. We have to put subject first. You will follow me. Then subject will be I. Me will be I here. Where I? Do you live? Present infinite tense. Tense. Change will, this will be changed into past infinite. So he asked me where I lived. So my dear students, let's go to our practice sheet today. So my dear students, come to this practice sheet. Interrogative sentence, direct. Rina said to me, do you require any help? So Rina said to me, so Rina, instead of said to, we have to put asked, then me. Do you require any help? It starts with the auxiliary verb. We have to put I. So you have to put if, sorry. You will follow me. Me will be changed into I because the subjective of me is I. Do you require any help? Present if tense. So change will be changed into past infinite tense. If I required any help. Did I, Rocky said to me, did you notice the board? So Rocky said to will be changed into asked me did you notice the board so it starts with did auxiliary verb we have to put if then you notice the board you will follow reporting verbs object me will be i here and look this is did you notice the board past infinite tense this will change into past perfect tense so if i had noticed the board okay next one fahim said to me are you will so fahim asked me are you will the sentence starts with auxiliary verb interrogative sentence we have to put he if so if you will follow me we have to put i here so if I, are you will present indefinite tense, will be changed into past indefinite tense. I was ill. Fahim asked me if I was ill. Rekha said to me, have you broken the plates? So Rekha asked me, have, it starts with auxiliary verb. So we have to put if, you will follow me. So if I, have you broken the plates, present perfect will change into past perfect. So you can remember like this, have has will be changed into had. So if I had broken the plates. Bina said to Rina, will you sing a song? So Bina said to instead of asked, Rina. So will you sing a song? It starts with auxiliary verb, but there is a choice. Will you sing a song? She can sing or not. So, in, in, if we find in a reporting space any choice, expresses any choice, in that case we can use whether. W E T is here. Instead of if, we can use whether. Bina asks Rina whether you will follow Rina. So, whether she, who is she? Bina or Rina? This is Rina. That's why we have to make a, for, uh, make a first bracket and put the first letter of Rina, R. Where she will will change into would where she would sing a song my mother said to me where are you going so my mother asked me so this sentence starts with double is word so it is set up if whether we have to put the double is word so where we have to make it assertive so we have to put subject first you will follow me I. Are you going present continuous tense? Will be changed into past continuous tense. So where I was going. Okay. My father said to me, which pen do you want? Like, so my father asked, asked me, double is word it starts with, so we have to put which, the double is word, which takes noun after that. So which pen? Then you will follow me. I. And do you like present infinite tense? We change into past infinite tense. We spend. My brother asked me, we spend. I liked. 
we are making this interrogative sentence to assertive that's why we have put subject and then verb Tahir said to me Tahir asked sorry Tahir asked me how double is word starts with w, how is also double is word how you okay so you will follow me follow how i did you go so past indefinite tense will be changed into past perfect tense how i had gone to school so tahir asked me how i had gone to school because this did you go to uh, school past infinite tense will be changed into past perfect tense so my dear students your sw will be is homework 8 summit on saturday change the following direct speech into indirect speech number one he said to me do you know me number two she said to me do you attend the did you attend the party number three she said to me where did you live number four he said to me whom do you look for number five nazma said to me have you taken my pen again i'm repeating number one he said to me do you know me number two she said to me did you attend the party number three she said to me where did you live number four he said to me whom do you look for number five nazma said to me have you taken my pen so my dear students uh, that's all my class today keep uh, do your assign is the blue at home and submit on saturday from 9 to 3 pm in the school library parents or anyone else can come to school for collecting and submitting the SW copies thanks for watching this class keep practicing at home about my parents stay safe stable see you again till then allah peace assalamualaikum